Hello, this is Tom from Vino 100 with your video wine tip of the week. Today I want to discuss Barolos and Barbaresco. They're both great famous wines that use the Nebbiolo grape varietal and they come from the Lange region within Piedmont region of Italy, which is the northern, northern region of Italy. Barolos and Barbaresco, or Barolo and Barbaresco refer to the towns or the villages where these wines come from and, and the surrounding area. Barbaresco has a slightly warmer microclimate than Barolos. So they're both big wines, they're both made with Nebbiolo grape. Oftentimes, not all the time, Barbarescos have a little more finesse, a little softer because the grapes ripen a little further uh, than the Barolos. <clears throat> also, Barbarescos don't need as much time to mature uh, as a Barolo. Barbarescos are oftentimes have to be aged for a year in a barrel, a year in a bottle before it gets released. Barolos are two, be two years in a barrel, a year in a bottle. So, first one I wanted to discuss is from the same estate as my Barolo, is Terra de Beau. This Barbaresco is beautiful Nebbiolo, big and brash, but it's got little soft tannins, softer tannins on the finish than my Barolo. This is $22 a bottle. It has that characteristic Nebbiolo flavor. It's like a smoky cherry, and it really ends very dry and really dries your mouth out. But it's a delicious wine. This isn't too expensive. Barbarescos often get up there. It's so same with Barolo. Very expensive wines. This is $22 Barbaresco. It's really worth the money. It's fantastic, especially if you haven't had Barbaresco before. This is a great intro, but it's a great value wine in general. Now, my Barolo is an 05. Uh, like I said before, Barolos usually age two years in the barrel, year in the bottle before they get released, at least. And this one is a bigger wine than my Barbaresco. It's from the same estate. Bigger, fuller, it's got little sharper tannins on the finish. This wine can age, they're both very long aging wines. This wine can age a little longer uh, than, than the Barbaresco just because the tannic structure is a little different. This one is, again, big and brash, very dry in the finish, nice smoky cherry, a uh, great wine to go with a nice big beef dish. This is $26 a bottle, very inexpensive for a Barolo. So that's my video wine discussion, video wine tip discussion for this week. Come out to my wine tasting on Sunday. It's uh, at 4.30 at the River Grill. You have to call me to make a reservation, but it's well worth it. We're going to have 25 wines, live jazz, buffet dinner. It's always a great time. You're overlooking the river while you're, you're sampling the wine. So give me a shout at Vino 100, and I hope to see you then. But have a great uh, weekend anyway. Thank you very much.